in Southern Indiana AAC consultant for Toby Dynavox. And today I wanted to talk about how to use the topic desk work. So I'm doing a couple of videos that I'm trying to kind of explain and give examples of how to really use Snap Plus Pro first and how to use them um, in real life scenarios. So today I um, wanted to talk about, again, desk work. So something that probably happens in the schools with some frequency. So again, when you open Staples Core first, you always open up to this core word page, which you can absolutely use for a ton of modeling, no matter what the scenario is. But topics is really scenario based, where you can find a lot of phrases that are socially acceptable within these topics. So I'm going to scroll down and find desk work here. So this is usually going to be a modeling situation until someone starts picking it up, correct? So maybe what are we doing? I need paper. I know the answer. I don't know the answer. Look at mine. I need a pencil. That's right. Oh, it's wrong. So this is a ton of phrases that we can use when we're doing desk work or helping a student do desk work and understanding the language through pictures. Um, topic words are again here under this topic. So teacher, classmates, help, which is a great one. School words are even listed here. So, I mean, look at all of these words, blackboard, binder, book, behavior chart. Those are all here. If we go back, we even have school people. So these are me best friend, bully, cafeteria, counselor, all sorts of vocabulary. And then if I go back even more, so I'm back within the topic desk work, and then I have my supports, right? So we've talked about these before, that every topic has their own supports, which you can absolutely edit, but I can have a visual timer. We're gonna do desk work for five more minutes, and then we can go outside to the playground. Or first we do our work, and then, or first we look, look at directions and then we complete our work. Um, maybe it's a show social story. Um, so at the end of the day, I clean up my workspace, I put my pens away, I wipe the desk and I have a nice clean desk. So again, these can be edited, but it's really great that they already exist if you're just quickly trying to use this with a student. Hopefully that helps a little bit on how to use um, different topics within the school system and um, the school day, because I know it can be somewhat overwhelming to have an AAC device in your classroom, but um, these topics are really designed to help you jump in and get started.